What's up everyone, it is your boy TechArtNotchit and today the box art for Black Ops 3 has been leaked as you guys can see on screen. This is really similar to the box art of Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2 as you guys can see on screen. It's basically like a soldier hunched with two pistols in his hand, similar to that of Black Ops 1. Now if you guys notice he's wearing, wearing a really futuristic armor which many people are assuming to be an exosuit. Now I believe that's not confirmed yet but I believe Black Ops 3 should be without exosuits or maybe like a different version of an exosuit. I didn't like exosuits too much in Sledgehammer game uh, in uh, Advanced Warfare. I feel it was a cool addition but I didn't feel it was necessary in multiplayer and many people do not like that idea but nevertheless comment down below what you guys feel whether you want exosuits to be returning to Advanced Warfare or not. Don't hesitate to leave me your thoughts in the comment section down below and also guys the description for Black Ops 3 has been leaked from the source code in uh, the Call of Duty website so I'm going to show you guys on screen right now and read it out for you. Uh, Call of Duty Black Ops series, the first title for next-gen hardware in the critically acclaimed Black Ops series, developed by Treyarch, the award-winning creator of the two most games in Call of Duty, most played games in Call of Duty history. Call of Duty Black Ops series deploys players into a dark, twisted future where a new bleed of Black Ops soldiers emerges, and the lines are blurred between our own humanity and the technology we created to stay ahead in a world where cutting-edge military robotics define warfare. With three unique game modes, campaign, multiplayer, and zombies providing fans with the deepest and most ambitious Call of Duty ever. So guys, this is clearly based in the future because there's cutting edge military robotics and it's basically saying we are waging a war against our own technology and the lines between the technology and us are blurring. So that'll be pretty cool. Now from the teasers guys, I feel there are going to be a lot of World War II references. So at least in the campaign, we might be shifting errors from the future to back in the past in World War 2. So guys, many people wanted World at War 2 and wanted a World War 2 based game. I mean, that would be cool, but I really like the future setting, maybe without exosuits or maybe a slight different variation of the exosuit. Uh, anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below, whether you wanted Black Ops 3 or World at War 2 also. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, don't forget to smash that like button and Subscribe for more Advanced Warfare as well as Call of Duty news and I will see you guys next time. I'm signing out. Peace.